With 13 consecutive playoff appearances, including state championships in both 2013 and 2014, the Woodlands Volleyball Program has established itself as one of the premier powers in the area. Here we go, let's go! And now, a senior-laden 2017 squad looks to leave its legacy in Lady Highlander's lore. Woodlands has a very successful volleyball history, and now it's my senior year, and I really want to get to state. Um, just like the two teams in the past have. Um, so that's definitely our goal this year. Definitely think we can go all the way to state, for sure. This is probably the best year I've ever been a part of, for sure. We're all so strong. We've all improved in different aspects of our game, and we're all so close. So I think that's most important. We're super tight-knit. I don't think anything's going to come, come in the way of that this year. People don't really understand, like, how much of a sisterhood that we are and really, like, the, everything that goes into being a team. Like, they come to the games, obviously, and they see that we're good, but... It takes a lot of dedication, and, and we really do become like a family. Those bonds tightened when the Lady Highlanders rallied to help teammate Allie Hayden when she had a seizure during a preseason team building event at a lake house. About like five or six of them were outside, and the rest of us were inside, you know, getting breakfast, watching a movie, and uh, one of our teammates comes running in, you know, saying like, call 911, call 911. She had a seizure, and all of us came together and made sure we all knew what to do. We, put her, we all watched Grey's Anatomy, so we all put her, put her on her side. We knew what to do, and we took her to the hospital and waited for the hospital with her. And she's good now. She's out there playing now, so it's all good. But that was a little scary at first. The Lady Highlanders pulled even closer as a group in the days following Hurricane Harvey, working together to gather donations for those hit hardest by the storm. They've been uh, trying to do their best to help out as far as uh, working the donation drives that when we hosted here on campus and they've also helped put together coloring packages and stuff for little kids that were in shelters. We did everything together donating and coming together and getting like store goods and stuff like that and helping out the community. Good line, Amelia. After coming up one win short of reaching state the last two seasons, the Lady Highlanders have a new motto for 2017, Fire Within. Our slogan is Fire Within and you know, they came about just kind of thinking about what is it that makes you perform your best? Why do you come out here every day and work so hard for this program? And, you know, I think that they built up a little more fire. We're really trying to use our heart, like, as motivation. We've been trying to, like, let that fire fuel us this year as we go forward. We've gone through it twice of losing in the regional finals. And that was probably the worst feeling I ever felt in my life. And so every practice and every workout and stuff like that, we think about that to push us to get farther and farther and to get that goal we want, and that's to win state.